Old Hickory Barbecue has been around Owensboro for five generations. No now. way. Current owner John Foreman claims that the secret is in their sauce. They also hold numerous rewards and prizes that they have won over the years. All right, I know you've been on shows like Barbecue Pitmasters. Do you have any intentions on doing any more competitions like that? Uh, maybe if they come along. I'm not really looking to do any. Okay. I kind of would like to go back on Pitmasters if I ever get the chance. Old Hickory Barbecue is the 2012 Barbecue Pitmasters Kentucky Champions. They use only wood, and the smoke gives it a unique flavor. So, with the barbecue festival coming up, do you have any unique preparations or anything different? We've got to cook triple what we usually cook. Okay, and how much is that? Uh, we'll probably be cooking 20,000 pounds a day for Ooh. probably the next you know, week and a half. That right there sounds a lot of meat. Can you tell me a little bit about your history and involvement in the barbecue festival? Uh, the Barbecue Festival, my, my dad, we lived in Lexington until we moved back to Owensboro in 1979 when I was nine years old. Okay. And I think that was the year of the first Barbecue Festival. So he missed the first one. Then mm -hmm. the second one, he helped him out with the serving lines. Mm -hmm. Then after, since then, we've had a booth down there ever since for so right. 30 plus years. Uh, we do a lot of things. I mean, we support a lot of the you know, like a lot of the schools. Mm -hmm. We donate to it seems like everything around. Here. All right. But you know we try to help out. You know if we have anything extra, we give it to the Latino shelter. Or, right. You know, but we're always trying to. You know, I do a couple of teams. I don't do a lot because I get so many. Right. But I sponsor. I mean, just it goes on and on. Right. John Foreman does a whole lot around the community as well as within his own. Sad, you know, it's just people come here from all over. Right. You know, I mean, I've had people that have come from France and from Canada just mm -hmm. to eat here. Right. Mr. Foreman even claims that people will drive all the way from Louisville just to have lunch at his restaurant. When asked, Mr. Foreman claimed that his restaurant should, in fact, be memorialized, and these are his reasons why. Right. But I think it's, you know, people grew up on, on Old Hickory. You know, there's mm -hmm. so many generations that grew up eating here, and I think it's just it's just kind of a staple of Owensboro. If you grew up here, you kind of want to come back and eat here. Mm -hmm. You know, it's just something you grew up on. Right. Same way.